trust you for 7,000 years and look where you got us. Are we really helping these people build a better world? Somebody call a doctor because bad medicine is back. You've got Diamond Dave Damone, the Appleton Oak Dave Bay, the answer. I am, of course, Mason Quinn. Guys, today we are checking out Eternals. Now, none of us have seen it, so I got to hear what your expectations are. Uh, you know, uh, an exciting part of all the superhero movies are watching the characters that we read comics about and saw in cartoons, cartoons growing up come to life. You know, that first time I saw Iron Man, it's the real Iron Man after the comics and stuff. That's what makes these movies so much fun. And when you don't know anything about the no. characters, <laughs> I couldn't tell you anything about any of them. It's a little bit hard to get amped up, so I'm going to try to go in with an open mind, but i got to be honest when I'm saying I'm keeping my expectations well. well. Same here. Don't know anything about the characters, which I'm happy about. I just want to be surprised, keep an open mind. I know there was a lot of hate uh, from critics and some fans about it, so I'm just looking forward to see what we got going in front of us here. <clears throat> You know, usually I know the most of like of us of the comics. Not, <laughs> yeah, not that, not that big time. But no, with the Eternals, I know very little, so I'm very excited to get introduced to a new slew of characters. So look, I'm going with it. Like these guys, an open, open mind. mind. With me, I love comic book movies, so I'm pretty sure I'm going to probably end up liking it. So we'll see how it goes. Also, I know nothing about these characters. I just want to be entertained and have some fun. That's all I'm looking for. <laughs> Well, with that being said, let's go! It is time. So are we kind of doing a tie-in with a little bit of Greek and Roman mythology here by the names? and uh, That would be planet Earth. <laughs> wow. This guy's quick. <laughs> Can't get anything past this guy. You guys are welcome. <laughs> oh! Whoa! Whoa! I thought they were talking about like a tidal wave That's or what something. That's I thought too. Okay, so they're going to start showing us uh, what they're capable uh, I, of. Those are deviants. Pretty cool looking. I don't want to be Debbie Downer, but so far I'm seeing Superman and Flash. <laughs> Connie, walking dead. Oh, that's right. Good call, Dave. And he was oh, in oh, Train oh. to Busan. Was that, that gentleman. Yeah, he was. There's Angelina. So she's the healer. Can we just celebrate the fact that there's a Pink Floyd song in a Marvel movie? That's what I was saying. For the intro, nonetheless. Yeah. yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> she's like, dang it. Mid the measureless grossness and the slag. And, and thank God there she is. I completely ran out of things to say, and these kids make I thought you were very charming, Professor. Who can tell me what an apex predator is? Randy Orton. <laughs> I was yeah, just going to oh, say that. Yeah. <laughs> you nerd. Oh, Randy God. Orton. Whoa. This is not an earthquake. No. Yep, just an earthquake. But they wanted to show that she had to use her power to save someone. Yeah. Oh, I see. It was just an earthquake. Uh oh. You want to die? What the hell? You've had too much to drink. <laughs> <laughs> this is from the Middle Ages. Happy birthday. Shit, that a genius? Oh, she just revealed herself. What is that thing? I did it! Well, whoops. Oh, it's going after her specifically. Yeah. Here, find you. Sprite! <laughs> <laughs> I can do this. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> oh, that's a cool 
trick. Oh, so hey. Sprite's got some cool powers here, too. Now this thing doesn't know who's who. Yeah, who was that? It's gotta be. <clears throat> oh, it's that guy. Here. Yep. Watch out! Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. It's a long way. And the bus disintegrated. Okay. What about the driver They're and the people in it? They're probably fine. You bring up a very interesting point. <laughs> nope, See? there's the driver. Okay. Oh, no. Ooh. Oh, nice. Oh, oh wait, that did that regenerate right? it? Yeah, it's regenerated. Oh, it's going to be harder to take down, dude. Wouldn't he be able to boil the water? We're Eternals from a planet called Olympia. We came here 7,000 years ago to protect humans from the deviants. We thought we killed them all five centuries ago. Why didn't you guys help fight Thanos or any war? We were instructed not to interfere in any human conflicts unless deviants are involved. Oh, perfect. There you go. <laughs> Whack! Take a seat. The old pie face. Eternal serving their missions across the galaxy. Learn from your success. I have noticed something special about this place. Do not become attached to this planet. You must focus on the true purpose of your mission. I understand. The supreme power there literally is like, blow off everything. Just focus on what we tell yep. you to do. Yep. It's an engine. Steam engine. It's a steam it's too engine. Soon. <laughs> the steam engine? This is five hundred BC. This yeah. is when this is happening. <clears throat> so he was gonna introduce the steam engine in five hundred BC too soon. Interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> uh -oh. You just calm down. Hey! your eyes. <laughs> 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 You're learning their language now. I can't wait to spend more time with you. I need to get to know them. How do you spell our cool? I'm your sensei. I feel hard work. With that dialogue, I get Game of Thrones when I hear him say it. <laughs> <laughs> 400 AD now. Okay, huh? so they jumped ahead 900 years. Yep. That was a long engagement. Maybe, <laughs> maybe Bahu Bali is going to show a up in 900, <laughs> a 900 year engagement. Hey, Jack. So she was just off living a life of solitude. Huh? She's fine. Hey, Jack. Come again, I was Dave? way wrong. <laughs> okay, Dave. Way wrong. Call. Ten thousand years, one of us has died. I think the deviant that attacked us in London killed Ajax and absorbed her power. Oh, that would make sense with being able to heal. Mm -hmm. Selma was only in this movie for just a little over <laughs> thirty minutes. <laughs> oh, oh, she got the communication now. Yeah. Are you sure you talk to Starship? What else would it be? Mad weary. Fifteen twenty-one, Roman Empire. Just the burning of Rome. Yeah. Someone correct us in the comments well, if we're wrong. <laughs> don't. We don't interfere in their wars. Their weapons have become too deadly. Lena. Everyone is going to die. Lena. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. What is going on here? Whoa, what was take yeah, well, who's taking over her? Jeez, she's going nuts. Mm -hmm. Dina, please, come back to us. Oh, Jesus. Oh. <laughs> Take a seat. Now I'm interested in knowing more about her character and what does that to her. Yeah. You have mad weary. 
Your mind is fracturing under the weight of your memories. And all I can do is erase you so that you can start over. They're asking her to let you erase who she is. We've trusted you for 7,000 years and look where you've gotten us. Are we really helping these people build a better world, huh? Yeah, this is it. Uh-oh. I was wondering if one of these guys were going to say make, screw the mission. Make them all forget why they're fighting. I'll watch over Vivian. Let her keep her memories. You may all go. The Vivians are gone. Find your own purpose. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, everyone, that was good. Ow! <laughs> My principal college are here. <laughs> Ajax dead. Was it deviant? Seven thousand years. That's how long the battle between Eternals. And <laughs> of course. <laughs> Gilgamesh. I'm sorry, Gil. Ajax dead. The attack triggered her. Hey, Fiona. Fiona. Everyone in Century 6 is going to die. Fiona. You're an eternal. The greatest warrior of Olympia. The goddess of war. Remember who you are. Hey, who's your gardener? <laughs> <laughs> is this the Century 6 Fiona was talking about? Yeah, it's a planet. She thinks she used to live there until it was destroyed. Oh, calls so coming in. She gonna go, yeah. Cersei, it is time for the emergence to begin. Destroy Earth and yeah. the uh, oh, internals. She's gotta come out of the shell. Wow, the internals helped set it up. I'm trying to the truth. She has helped many celestials to emerge. So have you. Earth was my first mission. It was home in Olympia. There is no Olympia. What? Oh. Did she get her memory wiped? That's why they had to go back to the ship. You go back to the ship that's and get their memory she, wiped. That's why Jolie keeps having these fits. Yeah, she's got too many memories from too long. The world board. It is here that I built and programmed the Eternals. That's a lot of Eternals. Wow. Why don't I remember any of this? Your memories are erased and reset after each emergence. Yeah, they are wow. stored here. Do not fail me. Well, that was a lot. That was a lot of world building right there. We have to stop the emergence. We're not going to let everyone on Earth die, right? Right. <laughs> <laughs> the one human. <laughs> <laughs> missed all of you make yourselves at home i've just been told i've been sent on a suicide mission for the past seven thousand years so excuse me for not giving a shit about your plan right now oh no hey stop worrying about me i'm dumped i didn't want to leave there's something I <laughs> oh <laughs> Very nice, sir. Are you mental? Hi! Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Ooh, she just got it erased. I've fought that one before. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this isn't good. We got a lot of them. Did you get that? <laughs> Oh, he's Ooh. melting that sucker. Gone. Hey, Rock. Let's go. I'm not leaving you. They are getting are whooped. Not having a good time here. Uh oh. 
Oh, wow. Uh, yeah. Remember, she can turn stuff into things by touching it, so I think she just erased them. It's a tree. <laughs> Are you all right? Okay, so... Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Oh no. Man. No. No. Oh no. no. Come on. Oh, no. no. no it's it's taking its power. its power. Wait, he survived it though? Nope. Just it's growing. What? Well, Whoa. I understand now. What, what is the that? hell? Perishing means nothing. Oh, that's obviously her Salma Hayek speaking. Yeah, okay. Took me a minute. Oh, come on. <laughs> well, now who's going to defend th them against her? Yeah, nobody's... I mean, Icarus is the next closest one who could fight. You are asking me to take control of a mind of Celestia. I do not have that kind of power. You'll need Fastos. You gave up on humans a long time ago. What's this? The plot. Why are we, why are we going back to Hiroshima? Oh, yeah. no. Fastos gave him the nuclear technology. I did this because my technology hadn't helped them advance. Knew he was right. Our mission was a mistake. Hi. Hello. Can we help you? Hey, Jack. Ben, these are my friends from college. Everybody's friends it's, from yeah. college. <laughs> Incredibly natural. Uh, Star Wars. I'm telling you now, they're giving me face again. I cannot help you. I'm never this leaving. I'm sorry, Cersei. I choose to use my hands to fix my child's bicycle. I don't use my powers anymore. Are you sure? What are you? The child is right down the hallway. <laughs> I'm just like someone for using his powers. Well, what's this even made of? Vibranium. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fall collection. Fall collection. Thank you. God, you're right. If there's a chance, you should take it. Yeah, why is he ignoring that? I'm just puzzled yeah. by it. Oh, I want to be oh, by my yeah, family, but save the world. Yeah, save they're gonna yeah. destroy the planet if you don't. Because he has a perfect safe house they can't get in, supposedly. <laughs> this is Makari. Or should I say this Havisham? Bracelets in theory shut down our regeneration process. So if the deviants can absorb our energy, what if we can absorb each other's energy as well? Oh, six days ago. How long do we have? Seven days. Oh, he's known the, the whole, whole time. time. We have to tell them the truth because together we might be able to stop new magics. It's just up ahead. I suspected you might have changed your mind. Can't let you betray Arashim. I'm too dumb to walk. It's the only path I know. Oh. I can't believe this. What a twist. Oh. This dude's got to go. Thinks he's doing the right thing. Yeah, he thinks he's, he's doing his mission, man. Yeah, so they can have a celestial and they can create another planet, universe. Behind the point of emergence. Uh-oh. He lied to us. What have you done? He killed her. No! You won't succeed against me, and I will kill every one of you if I have to. So is no one going to take a step up now? <laughs> we all have. Wait, right. I'm going with you. He's Sprite. I don't know because I think Sprite wants to forget this world because remember she supposedly had this crush on him the whole time. Where the hell are you going? I can't help you guys. I still think Icarus is right. I refuse to hurt any of you for my beliefs. Thirsty! We need to! The sphere inside of you. Maybe I can repurpose it, create a connection between uh, all of us that can activate the Unimind. This might sting a little bit. 
Filipino. <laughs> that was pretty oh, that great. was easy. Always got that bracelet. Oh boy, we're getting all kitted up for the oh, final battle. All got the bracelets on. Lena, play nice. Oh, but I've always <laughs> wanted to. It's time to put him up to sleep. What distracted just him. happened? Oh, she, she distracted him. Up. Yeah. No. They're, they're linking up to the Unimind. Jeez. Oh, is he going to cut the thing in half? Yeah. Oh, snap. Drig's gone. It's over. Well, that's interesting. Yeah. Fast off. Need to get closer to Jean. Keep her crews busy. We've got you. Go. Enough. Whoa, what's that? <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh. Oh, oh, no. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> they fight dirty. Oh, oh, there it is. Where's Cersei? You always did underestimate her. Oh, not so bad. Oh, nice. Uh, wait, <laughs> how come you couldn't use that before? You've been boss. <laughs> Bit of a run ahead of her. Oh, wait, what? What? Back? No. Powerful enough to do this. Oh, that's you know right. damn well. Yeah. Maybe I've changed. It's really who you are, Sprite. Oh. Are you really willing to let everyone on this planet die? What? What a bitch. Backstabber. Quite literally. literally. I've always envied you, Cersei. Oh, no. Now she doesn't know which volcano it is. Oh! Yes! Oh. Yes! Oh, she's not going down. Oh! oh. Got it! Oh. Or not. <laughs> she's got a form like. Stay here. <laughs> Give me your hand. Oh, here, she's gone. Oh man. Oh! Oh! oh. Uh, she, get, she get the head? Oh. She got the oh. oh yeah! Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> no, this is this is real bad. What? Oh You know, surprisingly, I was thinking there was going to be more effort, like... Yeah, yeah that's nice. nice. He can't do it. Oh, it's the uni mind. There, Dave. There's your little more effort that has to be put all in. All their powers. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Close to the sun. Did he just? Yeah, he. Uh, yeah, he just. He turned uh, his TV off. off. Did he just end it? I still have energy from the uni I think I can make you human. You will die one day. Are you ready for that? I am. You guys did that. I love you so much. <laughs> 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 you 
What's your superpower? Um, can you <laughs> 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 wow, Dad, Dumbo was so cool. Hey, Plastis, take care. Oh, hey. <laughs> You're gonna miss me. Me too. Remember when we talked about no more secrets? No more secrets, I promise. I have one I want to tell you. First. Uh. Yep. yep. Oh. I will spare them. Memories will show them if they are worthy to live. So what was he going to say? <laughs> oh, oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> All right. Seriously. <laughs> oh, my ears. My eyes are numb. What? Who is this guy? Brother of Thanos. The name of Mark. Defeater of Black Roger. Our box. No. Of mystery magic. <laughs> what? Is that Harry Styles? Your friends are in big trouble. And we know where to find them. Someone in drop us down some comments about who Harris. was that and what was Harrison that? Pip. It better be a sword. Oh, it is! Sure, you're ready for that, Mr. Whitman. Mr. Nope. Whitman, what? Yes. Come on, yes. Yes. these post credits will return. Gosh. Well, talk about confusion Ooh. on those post credits. There was the Eternals. Gosh, <laughs> guys, thoughts. Andrew, well, it's time for a whole new phase of Marvel movies, apparently, and it's gonna just be this. It's gonna be other than your staples with Spider-Man stuff. We had the Shang-Chi earlier, and now we have Eternals, where we get to learn about more comic book characters in this new phase. And then, obviously, with the multiverse, it's just going to be a bombardment of superheroes. And touching the sword, I have no idea where that means. None. So I'm looking forward to that, too. And your thoughts on the movie overall? Oh, uh, I guess I can go into that. Yeah, as you might well. as well no, start here no. rolling. Um, yeah, it was pretty. It was pretty good. I really did enjoy it because it's a comic book, but there was so many moving pieces. As someone mentioned, you know, when we eventually got to the Avengers, they each had their single movie. So I guess the Eternals, like, that's why they showed them real quick, having their own powers at the beginning. Uh, for me, I really did like it. I liked the action. Um, I just wish there was more that I knew about it because that's why I like going to see comic movies a lot. But on the answer scale, I'm going to give it a 4.1 out of five answers. Ooh. You know, me coming in with knowing nothing, it did help with that. But other than that, you know, it, it was full of action and everything, and had not as much humor as you usually would see. But I did through. I did really enjoy it, though. Yeah, guys, first time watching this, and again, uh, like answer stated, and I had said during the view, you know, we really don't know who any of these characters are unless you're obviously hardcore into the comics. Um, I, I found it a little hard to get into the characters, honestly. I mean, hey, you guys come here for honesty, so I'm going to give you honesty. I kind of had a hard time getting into the characters. I was like, what did they pay Angelina Jolie for? To just stand there and look <laughs> attractive? I guess that's what she's there for. But, uh, yeah, I, this, sorry, guys, this one was kind of a swing and a miss for me. Really didn't, the story kind of drug out a little bit. I didn't dig the characters. Uh, you know, it's tough when it's not your staple superheroes. It really is. Marvel's got an uphill battle to try to sell this new universe to people. So for you diehards, you're going to love it. For the guys who are just fans who loved, you know, liked the Avengers and got behind that, it was all it was all good. But I think it's going to be an uphill battle. Uh, two out of five answers for me on this one. I didn't find it very wow. good at all. Wow, he roasted it. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Uh, you know, I, it was entertaining overall. I mean, I was, I was entertained. Uh, I mean, so it's not, it's not a movie that I watched where I'm like, holy cow, I want my two and a half hours back because that was terrible. But at the same time, um, I also had a hard time getting into the superheroes, and I could not get over. 
And, and again, uh, I'll, I'll reiterate, I am not like a hardcore comic fan, so I don't know any of the backstories. I don't know any of their superpowers. But I got to be perfectly honest, guys. I felt like Icarus was just a knockoff Superman or <laughs> knockoff mean, what, Homelander. What was, what was his powers other than flying and shooting lasers out of his eyes? And we've seen that before. I mean, uh, you know, obviously there's only so many superpowers you can create. Yep. And, you know, uh, Athena's was unique. The one girl... Felt like a knockoff Flash. I mean, what was her or, or Quicksilver? I mean, what was the superpower other than running really fast? I mean, we've we've seen that before. Yeah. You know, I mean, so and you know the the turning water into rocks and stuff. I mean, that was unique. I mean, you know, Sprite's character was you know a combination of other superheroes, but yeah, almost a little no, low key. Like none of these superheroes were overly unique to me and none of their powers were like super like i was like oh wow that's awesome yeah. because because it wasn't unique um so um i felt like it was again an entertaining movie had i you know went and saw it in the theaters i wouldn't have left like super disappointed um it just wasn't my favorite movie i'll watch the second one when the second one comes out i'm gonna go see it um <clears throat> you know and, it, and it's not just because i didn't know the background story like shang chi yeah, um, didn't yeah. I didn't know the background yeah. story, but yeah. I thought that had more comedy. It that was, was awesome. It was more fun. The action was was better. So it's not just because, like, oh, you're not giving it a chance because these aren't popular superheroes. No, that wasn't it. It's just like, <laughs> sometimes like I said, that the, the main strong guy is just like a knockoff Superman. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, I mean, you know, like, when they're creating this guy, what should his powers be? fly and shoot lasers out of his eyes like yeah that's kind of that. uh, <laughs> can, can i interject here um so um i'm gonna give it i don't know i, w I was entertained i'll give it uh i'll give it a, a i don't know a 275 for maybe a 285595 <laughs> enter i'm not gonna say it was a good movie but it was entertaining ish all fair criticisms I get where you guys are coming from, but uh, for me, I'll start off with the, you know, how you started. Was I entertained? Yes. I was actually digging some of the characters, but to you guys' point, yeah, there was nothing different or unique about them because we, it does feel like we, it does feel like we have seen them before. Uh, as far as the story goes, I do feel like they tried, they had a lot. Yeah. That, right. They had a lot that they had to cram into this one, and I still don't feel like we got enough of what they can do yeah even though they probably just showed us everything for the most part um maybe there's more to this those post credit scenes i'm more focused on now right yeah it's I, and i know that's that's, that's like that's a typical the, the point that's yeah. they got you yeah the kind of well the reason why is because again coming in to this movie not knowing anything about the characters which i like doing on some stuff because it gives you an open mind and you try to keep focused on this story and not oh, what was written in the comic book 10 years ago those two post credit scenes have me intrigued because I have no idea what that leads to but I'm sure if some of the diehards do know this or know what's going to go on please drop those comments down below give us some education on that so we can be better for Eternals 2 when that comes out um, I didn't expect some of the death scenes that we got that's for sure I thought for sure with Selma Hayek we were she was going to be like the main star, yeah. but yeah. 30 minutes in, yeah. gone. But they kept it going with those flashbacks. This, yeah, this probably could have been better off as like a episodic feature on Disney Plus instead of having it be a two and a half hour movie. That's fair too. Yeah, uh, what I was going to ask was, do you guys think this would have been better had maybe two or three of the characters gotten their own movie and then they would have done? Can you, well, with the way that how many of these yeah. characters can you give? their own movie to well i mean you could have had a little bit more depth with obviously maybe with the main character and what she had to do and then maybe another but it's like you said dave they had to cram everything into one movie and i, I felt myself just being kind of like oh, here we go again you know kind but of. It, they did an okay job yeah. but it, i still feel like there's maybe some stuff left on the table maybe they did that intentionally yeah. who knows uh but for my rating i'm going to give it a 3.8 on the answer scale out of five Again, I was still entertained. I'm actually looking forward to now with the Internals 2 because I want to see what Kit Harrington is all about. We still have some 
unanswered questions here from this one, so I'm hoping in internals too it ties it in. And real quick, the eyes. I don't know how to feel about the whole Thanos thing. Well, well why did you help out when Thanos was around? That made good oh, sense. It made good sense. Did, I thought they did a they good job. It, yeah. it did yeah. make some good well. sense yeah. for the they most part, but that's true until they found out at the end. So whatever. <laughs> Three point eight is what I, what I'm rating it. So I just want to say one thing before we go. I have to imagine that this is going to be a complete and utter, you know, I gave it a 27585. This is going to be a merchandise dud for Marvel. What kid is going to be like, I want an You'd Icarus, be surprised. I want an Icarus <laughs> toy for You'd Christmas. be surprised. Or I want, like, no. <laughs> That's not dude, kids yeah, buying dude, it. That's grown dude, men. Yes, <laughs> dude, dude, they had the toy line during Christmas. It was sold out. The whole aisle was gone. Anything Marvel is License to print money. Yeah, guy, because the good stuff sold out first. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Christmas Doesn't matter. morning got to open up. Oh, it's just, it's. It so doesn't big. even it's matter. So kid gets Eric Rowan. <laughs> you live on yeah. and live. It's Icarus. He's the guy who, who shoots the lasers. From do, his do you have an action figure? <laughs> Enough said. So there you have it for Diamond Dave, wow. Appleton, Hulk, Mason Quinn. I have, of course, the answer. Good night now. And typically we would sign off on that, but if you found this reaction somewhat entertaining or us schmucks just shooting the shit here, we ask that you consider that subscribe button. We have a hefty goal now of 25,000 subscribers. So consider that subscribe button. And let's get down in the comments because gosh darn it, we need some of you brainiacs who know this stuff to give us some education on it. Answer, tell them again. So for Diamond Dave, <laughs> the non-action figure Appleton Oak, Mason Quinn, I'm of course the answer. Good night now.